From competing for an opening day roster spot to having one of the hottest bats in the Nationals lineup, Yadiel Hernandez isn't your traditional player. The Nationals signed the Cuban outfielder in 2016 at 29 years old. The Nats haven't historically been big in the Cuban market as Cuban players tend to be more expensive and they've dedicated a lot of their international resources into developing their Dominican program. But Nationals assistant GM Johnny DePuglia liked what he saw. Yeah, yeah. Fast forward four years, September 2020, got some carry. Hernandez made his major league debut at 32 years old. When he first came over to us, we were both in double A together, and it was pretty evident right away that he could really swing it. He played the game the right way. Now, Davey Martinez doesn't have a choice but to keep him in the lineup almost every day. It doesn't matter if you're, you're left-handed, right-handed. I mean, he, he has good at-bats, and, uh, and right now he's swinging that really well. So far this season, in 29 games, he's leading the team with a 327 average and a 490 slugging percentage. And his 856 OPS is the third highest on the team. Wow. I mean, really, I mean, but, you know, I've said this before, you got to hit. Hernandez won't be a free agent until 2027, when he's almost 40 years old. I mean, I'm really glad he's on our team, and I mean, he, he's a, for sure a tough matchup for anybody, I think. But all that matters right now is that his bat is exactly what the Nationals need. Those type of histories, they don't make you um, realize how, how big is baseball, how important is baseball for uh, Latin America, and he's a great example of that. For Mass and All Access, Amy Jennings.